what are you doing? How are you doing? How are the kids? How's the dog? How's the cat? I don't know. Um, I'm back. I'm back with another video. My name is Sari Vargas, in case you didn't know. Should say it down there. Feel free to subscribe to this channel if you have not and you feel like seeing this face again at any point in your life. Um, today we have a Shein haul. So, Shein's one of them companies and it's kind of like, like, oh, like, get my debit card information stolen. I don't know. Is the package going to show up? I don't know. Like, you really just... You, you might feel like you don't know, um, but some of you have maybe shopped with them multiple times. This is my second time buying stuff from them, um, but it is one of those websites where don't expect uh, the clothes to be amazing quality, but expect the prices to be <laughs> really, really reflective of that, okay? So none of this costs very much money at all. And let me find the invoice. Here it is. Here they are, I should say. This is them. Oh, they didn't put the prices. Everything is extremely inexpensive. It's dumb and expensive. It is ridiculously inexpensive. So I'm gonna do my very best to actually link everything. And what I did, because the last thing I need is more clothes, um, but <laughs> such is my, you know, life here. But what I did is I ended up going and buying all of the best sellers, all of the restocked because you loved it. I bought everything from that area. So these are the best sellers and things of that nature tried out on an actual like body that you can see um and i definitely read the reviews and i tried to you know use my better judgment when going through and looking at what stuff is made of and what it's not made of and whatever and um this is what we got so this is the first outfit i think it works out so i got this in a 2xl but i'll put the prices or i'll link everything down below because like i said it's all very affordable that's kind of the appeal of Shein and uh what are the other ones Romwe and uh you know the other ones I've done a bunch of them I forget what they're called they're all basically selling the same thing though so um anyway I I've been pleasantly surprised like no the quality is not amazing but yes it actually doesn't look too bad it doesn't look bad right so this arm I didn't pull it up but this is a two-piece set and you can obviously adjust it I left it down so that you could see the normal length. I have Big Bertha arms. This is not a stretchy material whatsoever, and they fit perfectly. So this one I actually went ahead, they're like, it's not tight at all. Um, they went ahead and, I went ahead and tied it, and then this as well, it comes down farther, further, farther, comes down farther. Wait, is farther distance, and no, further is distance, farther is, I've, I've, I'm, I'm, I'm further ahead than you are, I'm farther, further oh no i talk about this with my boyfriend all the time because he always schools me on it and and clearly i don't listen so anyway um yeah this actually goes a bit longer huh, than um than it is right now but i went ahead and tied it up and then the entire back is stretchy so it can definitely accommodate some different bust size i i mean if i had bigger boobs i could definitely i could definitely shove them in here um it's not bad. It's a thinner material, of course, like I said. You're not going for the thickest, longest lasting items here. You're probably going for, you know, one, two, three time wear, and then she's out of there. For some of it, some of it might be a little bit better. And then the bottoms, the entire top is super stretchy. Again, the material on the bottom is not stretchy, but it's so loose and flowy that it doesn't need to be. The whole thing opens up, but it does lay flat. It's actually a pretty nice length it covers the whole butt i would totally wear this like this is a really cute outfit it feels really good two thumbs up okay let's keep this show on the road and hop it to the jam jams all right these look obviously terrible on me they fit super duper weird it is a set um they have the lace on the bottom and it doesn't it it, it feels really cheap like the um the lace feels really cheap and it's just not gonna do anything for this body that it's on right now. And then this is just a stretchy um, lace fabric. There's really nothing, there's nothing else to it. It covers the uh, cups and then it goes up, you know, a nice wide band in the back or whatever. But it's very, it's very um, flimsy. But again, everything is so inexpensive that I struggle to like even critique the quality of it. You are getting exactly what you pay for with Shein. Don't forget it. And I'm not saying that's a bad thing. For some, for some reason, um, the back of the strap is detachable. The front is not though, so I'm not sure what was going on there. I mean, it's gonna be a no for me, dog, obviously. This was also a 2X, uh, yeah, 2XL. I mean, it's too much to ask for the denim to fit. I know that, and that's because for some reason, maybe it, it must just be more expensive or something. Um, 
but for some reason they never ever 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 have stretch in their denim like and if they do it is a really funky stretch so I bought these knowing they didn't have any stretch in them these overalls here and I actually think they're really cute like the style is cute and the color is cute and the length is not um like awful awful I mean they don't fit so they don't look good on me but the Overall, the actual denim, like if I was a size smaller, so I got these in a 2X and um, I'm normally a 16, 18, more of an 18 right now, unless it's like a true plus size brand, then I'm still 16. But um, yeah, if, if I got them bigger, I think I would have actually kind of like really liked them. Um, but as it stands, they don't fit because I am too big or they are too small, I do not know. I obviously did not get these buttons up. I mean, I could shove myself into it, but for what, for why, for who. So um, I also grabbed this little t-shirt from them. This is actually not a bad t-shirt, like the way it feels. It's got a nice little stretch in it. it, it sits well. It's got like a good little hang to it. I'm a fan. I mean, it's got regular length and it has like a little wannabe Rolling Stone looking tongue, right? Is that who has the tongue? Ah, is that who has that? I think so. I mean, I understand why the tongue is dripping, but why is the lip dripping? Is that just supposed to be more slobber or is it melting? I don't know. <sighs> okay, you like my new low bandana? This came in the package. I do not think, oh, for a second that looked like a tattoo and I was like, I don't have a tattoo. Anyway, um, I, I, I know this is not like supposed to be a bandana. I'm quite sure, in fact, that it's meant to go here who the hell knows? I ordered this like two weeks ago and I don't have that kind of memory up in this brain. But um, it's already kind of showing my bra a bit. So if I put the tie around here and bring it in to do this, it's gonna like just show the whole bra. So I actually don't mind it being kind of just loose. I mean, I would have to wear a bra otherwise like, I mean, my boobs don't like sag too low because that's kind of the benefit of them not being too big. Um, but still, there there would be probably some nipular action happening down here, and that's that's something I try to avoid in, in my 30s now. Um, so it is a one piece. It's like a little romper, and the bottom here has a little second, it has like a ruffle on it. I don't know if you can even really tell, but it does have a ruffle. It's obviously the thinnest thing that has ever graced my body. You can see everything. It's not going to be like super flattering if you look like me, maybe, but some people don't care about things that look flattering, and also... Some people don't look like me, so um, yeah. And then in the back, obviously, I just have a pair of black full coverage panties on and you can see how full the coverage truly is through the material. Overall, it is a nice, easy, comfortable fit. Like, I feel extremely comfortable right now. How do you feel about the little bandana looking thing though? Like, can I pull these off? I see people that sell these and I would never in my life think to buy one, but I I mean, I don't hate it. I'm not a hat or a bandana or anything kind of person. In fact, let me do it right so that you guys can actually see the item because I didn't come here to play. I came here to educate people. These also tie, um, I accidentally tied it as a halter top first and I kind of preferred it that way, but uh, I wanted to show you guys the you know item the way it's meant to be. So if I'm not mistaken, this is what it's supposed to look like. So this is also very cute or do the little bandana thing. You live your life how you want to live it, sister. And that's that's it. This is a 2X. Again, this was probably the cost of like 19 Cheez-Its. I mean, the clothes are so inexpensive. I cannot stress enough that I'm here mostly to show you the fit because the quality is the same across the board. You can probably wear it one, two, maybe three times if you are hoping and praying and wishing. Um, but yeah, beyond that, I can't help you there. Okay, so with this one, it's a two-piecer. It's a two-piecer. They're actually sold separately. This is just kind of your basic skater skirt. Um, it's I, My skater skirts tend to be a scuba material normally, and this is not a scuba material, but um, this is not bad. It's not like super see-through or anything. Is it kind of short? Oh, okay. Got a little... <laughs> Got a little booty back there today, so um, it's a little bit short if I pull it up to my like normal place on my waist, but for the most part, this is a good length. It's nice long length in the front and then in the back. Actually, it's not so bad. Yeah, it's not bad. It's a, I have a few inches. For sure, I would be comfortable wearing this with the length that it is. And then um, it's just got a nice stretchy top on it. Again, I got this in a 2XL. And then this top is just a very simple little crop. And um, are these stretchy? Yeah. Yeah, the... the what are these called? The, so the shoulder bands. 
um, the straps. So the straps have a tiny bit of stretch to them and then it's just kind of um, this little tie-dye material and it says babe across it. It's nice and thick and this is pretty much your everyday crop. Like, there's nothing like standing out about it being different or anything. So it's cute, it's comfortable. This whole outfit actually, I could see buying this at like Forever 21. That's, the, the quality on this um, I feel like is a little bit higher than the previous one that I just showed you and it's not quite my style together, but separately, I could see myself wearing both pieces. Okay, I kind of love this, the top especially. So I put it on the other way first, where this was in the back and it wouldn't close on me, so I gotta assume that this is supposed to be the back. But frankly, if it fits you um, around your bust properly, like if I didn't have a bra on, it probably would've been fine. Um, you could probably wear this either direction. That's totally up to you. I'm not sure what way they think is right, but um, it fits fine either way. I mean, like I said, mine just didn't quite close enough to cover my bra and boobs and stuff. Um, and then the arms are really comfortable and they're big and open. And this actually has some give to it, which is very different than the other stuff I have shown you. Um, this is a really cute top. Like I like the color. I would totally wear this top. And then the shorts, if my stomach wasn't so pronounced, so maybe if I had like a control um, brief on or something, which I do have a bunch of those. So maybe I could see myself wearing this. Um, but the set together is like, pretty cute and um, I kind of wish it was a skirt or it had some like extra flowage happening here but the length is really good there's plenty of inches back there past the butt I don't feel totally exposed is it totally see-through yeah it's definitely it's definitely see-through to some extent I would say it's a little bit thicker than the one that I just showed you but overall like it's pretty cute set and like I said I could definitely see myself wearing the top because I mean nothing is double lined like don't expect that but um, it's still really cute if you wear something nude colored or even if you didn't wear a bra, you just wore the sticky kind. This is cute. Ah, okay, so this shirt, it's another kind of regular shirt. It's just like the other one. This one, it's just like a vinyl that's put on there. Um, and this one says blessed and it has like obviously kind of the shape of the cross on here. One of my kids has a shirt just like this and um, I just thought they would get a kick out of me having one too. So. Anyway, this fits regular, it's just a t-shirt, looks good, feels good, all good. And then these shorts, I got some of those paper bag kind of shorts, the paper bag pants shorts though. They're not stretchy once again, I mean the pockets work and everything. These ones I'm able to get up and close and stuff around me uh, because the top is that paper bag type where it's elastic. So it is elastic, it goes all the way around, it's not very flattering on me. Um, it's a little low, it's a little loose here, which is odd. And then it does come with this belt, which I didn't weave through because you get it. And also I don't really wear belts. But um, if I was a little bit smaller, or if my body was shaped a little bit different, these would probably be just fine. But I can't wear denim that doesn't have stretch in it. It's not for me. It's not meant for me. I know it's not for me. Some things are just not for certain people and denim with no stretch is not for SRV. Not me, uh-uh, no way. So this little set actually comes together. Again, I got it in the 2X. This is very similar to the other ones. Has a slightly looser fit, I think. Um, a decent length on it. There's no pockets or anything. It's just a single line. It's There's no double lining. There's no extra lining or anything on the inside. Um, and then this one also comes with the little belt, which I believe this thing has loops on it. Yes, it has loops on it. I didn't weave it through, but it does have loops on it. And then this is just kind of your basic ribbed crop top. It doesn't have the same amount of stretch that I'm kind of used to. Um, I tend to get my crops like this, my very basic ones. I get them for $5 from Target. If you have a Target and that's available to you, I think the plus size ones are six or $7. Don't get me started. But um, I get the XXLs or the XL sometimes uh, from Target and like I said they're very similar to this but I find that they have a, a better stretch like something about this feels like it's gonna get stretched out and it's gonna stay stretched out versus those ones which I can wear all day and they feel good but this did come as a set so I mean take that into consideration I suppose but not bad not bad not bad okay let's get into the swimsuits now because they were a lot of best-selling swimsuits <laughs> Okay, this, this, sorry, we are getting into the swimsuits, they're nice, I forgot I had this one. This, how does it look? Does it look terrible? Do I look crazy? Does it look cute? I can't really tell because I don't have my monitor in here. It goes up on the side, it covers my butt. Oh, well, I got a little, got a little cheeky poo out there, but, um, I mean, this is not meant to be like a weird out of the house kind of outfit, I assume. Unless you're really living that hot girl summer. I am, on the other hand, living a fat girl summer and I just stay at the crib and 
hang out and I have like mad air conditioning and that's really all you need in life. So, um, yeah, this is not velvet. This is like velvet's like mutant cousin. I don't know. It's got a little stretch to it. It's thinner than cheese. <laughs> it's very, um, it's very, very, very lightweight. That's what we'll call it. Let's be positive. It's very lightweight. Uh, it fits better than the other one because it has that little bit of stretch to it. But yeah, it, this, this is making me super hot. I don't know how to explain this. It's making my skin really hot. Why is it making my skin feel hot? I don't know. Okay. Looks cute. I would take maybe like a little Instagram pic with it or something. I don't think I would actually wear this to sleep though just because my skin doesn't like it. <laughs> this looks extremely familiar to me. Like do I already own a swimsuit like this? I don't know. So the top I had to get in a 1X and I feel the difference. It's definitely a, a little snuggy, snuggy poo fit, but that's also because I have my bra on. So actually, I think if I took my bra off, I'd probably be okay. It's just kind of short, but again, I think it's because I have the bra on. So it's cute. It's like a little marble kind of color. Um, it's it's not the best swimsuit top I've ever put on, but it is pretty, and I feel like it, I'm sure it would do its job. It would stay on. And then I got these swim bottoms, which I got in a 2X, and they have a tiny bit of ruching here on the side. It doesn't really go to the front. Um, but it has it on the side and they are high waist and they are pretty much a full, right? Are they a full coverage? Yeah, pretty much a full butt coverage on here. So not bad. I mean, it's cute. It's cute. It's cute. I, I like it. Let's just, you know what? Let's just stay up here for a minute because this is actually kind of cute, right? Isn't it? A little bit. So you can't adjust the way that it comes in. Unfortunately, this is kind of just a bow for fun. Um, you can't bring it any further in. Otherwise, I probably would bring it just a little bit in just so that some more of my boobs could be covered, but it's pretty cute. It has a little ruffles on the bottom, and then it has a pad in here, which is, it's folded over right now. But um, it's got a good little uh, band on the back. It's pretty cute overall. And then we get to the bottoms, and the bottoms are like not as cute for me overall. <laughs> um, they're just too low for me. This is not a good look. Uh, in my opinion, this is not a good look for me. They're too low. They need to come up about another two inches. Um, but I would actually probably keep the top and use it because it is really cute. It's a color I don't have. It's a color I don't really use. Uh, but yeah, these look like underwear on me. And not like cute underwear, just underwear. But I think I bought this to go over it. Yeah, so this is like this little jersey-ish looking cover up and it is blue and pink, very bubble gum, bubble yum. And I think I got this just to kind of like tie over it, but and you know what, this does not fix the problem. <laughs> I don't know if I thought this was gonna be longer, I just don't remember what I ordered. But I'm sure though, if you did have this and you wanted to tie it off, like it is a cute little color combo. And again, this one's in a 2X, so it's a cute little cover up, especially with some jeans probably. So if I had a matching like bathing suit top underneath, I would put this on with like a pair of my jean shorts. That's a cute little look, but uh, this is, this is a no. Okay, this one, I mean, I know why it's on the best sellers one. Like, it's just way too cute. So it has these striped bottoms. They are blue, whoops, that's my underwear. They are blue and black. They're a little more fitted than those black ones I showed you. They have that bit of ruching on the side. They just feel a little tighter and a little bit lower in the back. Like, they don't quite come to this part right here on me. Um, but they're pretty much a full coverage. I mean, you're gonna be able to see through them a bit, and if they get wet, probably a bit more. And then the top, as you saw in the back, it's like a totally covered back, which I like sometimes, because it's like kind of hard to cover that area with sunscreen sometimes, and it tends to get burnt. Um, but then it has like two little pads in here. It has the bow thing here on the bottom, and you can pull it tighter, but I mean, you can only go so far, because once you close the hole, that's kind of it. But it's, I mean, overall it's pretty cute. I took my bra off so that you could get like a better feel <laughs> for the fit, because otherwise it was like a little bit small. Uh, but if you are chestier, a little busty boo, I don't know. I mean, I guess if you're smaller around, but you have bigger boobs, then like this might work. But otherwise, I wouldn't feel like the absolute most secure in this top. Because um, me personally, I feel like I am currently filling it. Uh, so if you're much bigger than this, then maybe not the one for you, but I have two more to show you. Does this look good? Because it like fits terribly. It's like so cramped up here. It reminds me of the Torrid Swim tops that are like too damn constricting up here. So it's real fitted. It is a cute little design and it has the pads, which are again shifted and folded right now. Um, but it's just, it's so snug. Uh, it's not really what I would call comfortable. I mean, I guess I can make the straps longer, but I don't think it's the straps problem. Um, and then the bottoms, 
Again, the exact same design basically. So the ruching on the side, they come up nice and high in the front. I have worn like inexpensive bathing suits actually in pools before and sorry, my eyelashes are killing me. But um, what happens is the every now and again the color will bleed a bit and like in the pool and then sometimes it'll bleed actually just on the fabric itself so when it dries like the colors look a little bit more blown out um, but also a lot of times they just get more transparent so <laughs> just be advised if you're actually getting in the pool with some stuff that um, that's a possibility I'm not saying it's gonna happen but it could and then again it's not quite all the way up um, I feel like they could definitely use another inch in the back or at least I could use another inch in the back but I mean it's a cute suit it's just really uncomfortable for me we have that mid rise trouble again down here not a good look for me it looks like too tight underwear not good from the front not good from the back um, however the top is cute I have one very similar to this from Charlotte Russe or Rue 21 one of those stores and I loved it I think like I like it when you do have a bit of a um, a smaller chest proportionate to the rest of your body, which for me, that's what I'm talking about when I say that like I have a smaller chest. It's because the rest of my body is so big, like for the fact that, you know, so my boobs just look a little bit smaller than everything else I have going on. But for a chest like this, I personally love this style because it pulls them in and it looks cute. It looks like we really filled something out here, you know, versus there's actually just not that much material and we, you know, did what we could, but we tried our hardest. So, um, for the bottoms, I mean, I'm going to stick with the rivers and the lakes that I'm used to. I'm not going to be going to Shein for swimsuit bottoms, but for the tops, I could definitely see myself maybe picking up a few of these in the future just because they are so inexpensive. This has pads in it. I would probably take them out because they're so weird it feels like I have little egg cups in here like there's I don't like them um but overall like it's a cute little top and unfortunately they're sold as sets I mean unfortunate for me because I can't make them both work but um they are sold as sets and that's actually all that I had for you guys so <laughs> I hope that you enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up you know if you want to see anything else from any of these types of places you can leave it down below whatever you want to see and um yeah I think that's all I have so I hope that you guys are having a really amazing day I upload like right now like five days a week on my vlog channel i have been cranking them out um and even my kids channel has a couple of new vlogs so if you guys haven't checked those out before you can see the links for them down below and i'll do my best to link all of this stuff in the description box for you guys so i hope you're having an amazing day and i will see you in my next video bye guys <laughs>